Welcome. My name is Murayo Afolabi Brown, and with me today is Kike Lomo Atondawo. Welcome, Kike. Many thanks for having me. So, Kike will be sharing with us her experience with Unica. Since the COVID pandemic, many universities moved exclusively online. Now, lots of students were hesitant in actually taking an online study. How was your experience taking an online MBA with Unica? All right, many thanks for that question. I think before I answer your question, let me first of all establish that. I run a consulting firm. I facilitate trainings for most organizations, top organizations to be precise. I also own a media platform called Real Talk with Kike, both on TV and radio. And of course, I also have a foundation. So I have a lot of things going on. Aside being a mother, a mother of three beautiful children. However, I know that it's not easy combining all of this with online study. And I know Unicap provided me with two privileges. And the first privilege is the work-life balance. The second privilege is the career pivot that they also give me. Because I know the first privilege is actually each um, on the fact that I was able to balance all of the three things that I just mentioned earlier. Mm. And the second one actually, you know, it's actually a good one because without jeopardizing the also and the, uh, the home front, basically, playing the role of a mother mm. at the same time still being able to study. And I think that that is one of the beauty of the online study that Unicap provided. And I think that's one of the best decisions right. ever that I took, I think two or three years ago to right. be precise. Yeah. Right. So Kika, tell me, why did you choose Unica for your NBA degree? I chose Unica based on my girlfriend introducing the school to me. At the time, I, was, I wanted to sit for my second degree. Mm. And I've been speaking to quite a number of schools. And she insisted that UNICAF is the best school to partner with at the time. And basically because of the generous scholarship and the flexible study mode, uh, the flexible payment plan as well. Though I paid my money in full, but at the same time, I feel that it gave a lot of women, you know, a lot of people, you know, the privilege to, you know, spread their payments instrumentally without not giving them a lot of stress. And um, even though I felt that I could combine my work and family and, of course, study together with all of this seamlessly mm. was one thing that made me to actually finalize with mm. uh, Unicap. And I must say that they've done a wonderful job thus far. Mm. So as a successful entrepreneur, consultant and media personality, how would you say the Unicap scholarship has helped you to advance your career? in this industry? All right, as an entrepreneur, I think the Unicaf uh, platform has given me the necessary skills and knowledge uh, that have benefited thus far in my career today. Because the advantages is about career opportunities mm. and um, the higher salary and the number of benefits from my colleagues that they've shared with me and also in our WhatsApp group when it comes to the success stories after they've sat for their MBA with Unicaf. Mm. Now, focus, people have really, really struggled to stay focused online. You know, it's hard to stay online. I remember during the pandemic, my kids, you could, hard, you could, you could, you could it was difficult to get you to actually get them to study, you know? So um, how have you stayed motivated and focused for an online degree? How was that for experience? To be you? honest, Mario, it's, it's not an easy affair, but I had to learn how to study at my own pace. And the support from professors from, from UNICAP were, were very resourceful. And in breaking down the assignments and other academic work, uh, I think that they've made it very seamless for most of us who chose to um, study uh, MBA online. And I think that that's one of the benefits, really, mm. um, as an um, entrepreneur mm. or as an adult or who has a family work unit right. and you're still trying to find a balance with everything. You keep mentioning your friends and the network you've made. Tell me about the highlights of your Unicap experience. All right, I think the highlight of my Unicap experience is the fact that I didn't do it alone. I had familiar faces mm. and um, studying at my own pace and customized payments, uh, especially payment plan uh, for most of us, uh, especially for my colleagues or my friends, uh, to be precise, was one of the most favorable exchange rates at the time, uh, especially in the market industry when it comes to buying dollars and exchanging Naira to dollar, to be precise, because I know that it's, it wasn't an easy one. Schooling in UK and trying to have um, change your <laughs> money to dollars yeah. and all of that. And I think that that's one of the favorable things that I can tell mm. you that we, we actually enjoy, especially with the fact that there's a presence here in Nigeria. And I think that that's what most schools actually need to tap into because most times we tend to want to communicate with the school directly without not having 
a workforce right here in Nigeria. Right, and right. I think that's another way of them empowering our people, mm. which I must say thumbs up to them. So, Kike, what would you say to a friend thinking of applying for a UNICAF scholarship? Do you think it's worth it? It's worth it. It's competitive. And I must say that the flexible work schedules, the affordable um, education, and of course, changing opportunities. And I feel that, of course, also meeting quite a number of people, you know, people that uh, you have like minds, intellectual equals, I think is one of the things that I actually would say it's worth it for anybody who would like to actually go through this course with UNICAF. I think that uh, for me, it's about the work-life balance and the fact that UNICAF is one of the schools that actually has given most Nigerians a platform to empower people. As far as I'm concerned, I feel, I feel that it's about giving back to the society. Right. Because most schools in UK, I don't want to say just UK as in abroad, basically, they do not have a physical appearance or unit in Nigeria. Right. And I feel that that's where all these other organizations, they come into Nigeria, they take our money away, they don't pay tax, they don't do anything. But what I love about Unicaf is the fact that they're empowering our people. Yeah. And that is one of the good things that I mm. admire about them. Right. And I must say that again, I'm happy to be in your midst. And I'm yeah. happy to see you again. Yeah! yeah. It's been a long time. So, but, I know. I mean, thanks for sharing your story. And I'm really, really happy that um, you've been able to inspire a lot of women to not just continue with work career, but to also improve and develop themselves mm -hmm. at an affordable price. Thank you very much for sharing your story with me today. You're welcome. There you have it. We'll be speaking with Kike Lomo Atandawu, who has shared experience with the Unicap Scholarship NBA degree. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm.